What's good, everyone? It's your girl, Tika Deshaun. Thank you all so much for tapping in and tuning in to All Things Ruthless, home of the Ruthless Addicts. All right, you guys, let's take a stroll into Eden. What's their next move? All the Queen's Men character breakdown. So first, we have the one and only Blue. Blue is going through it, you guys. Blue has been almost taken out by Fernando, and she wants Madam to act. She wants Madam to go right ahead and take Fernando out. But Madam, of course, is saying no. Now is not the right time, and Blue is upset about this. You know, she's saying, so Madam, we can take out his wife, but we can't take out his brother. Speaking, you know, is referring to concierge, and Madam is like, no, we just need to just wait and watch and see what's going on. See, because we don't even know what concierge is. So, Blue is like, listen, I need you guys to listen to me. I need you to hear me. I need you to understand that I am really pissed off about this situation, and we need to do something about it. But again, no one is listening to her in regards to reacting. Even Tommy has to tell her, you know, that she needs to calm down. Initially, when that truck got blown up, she was afraid. She was literally afraid to get into her own vehicle. So she rode with Tommy to make their way to Madam's home. Now, of course, they didn't tell Madam what happened that very night, but they did wake up that morning let madam know what was going on and again madam said that they needed to basically hurry up and wait we got to find out where uh where the concierge is and then we're going to react so you guys then we see madam who has received a phone call as well so she received this phone call from concierge and concierge is like I am going to, basically, we're going to hang someone that you love from the bridge in the Guadalajara. We're going to um, hurt something that you love. So, the two things that I can think of, you guys, and I've said this already, but the two things, people, that I can think of would be Madam's father as well as her business. Um, is Concierge's plan to destroy the business of Madam? You guys, this is an exclusive moment that I have for you all. So I was taking a look at Cab Casting, who does all of the, you know, casting for a lot of Tyler Perry's films, movies, etc. And for this particular one, there is a clip that is asking for, or a casting that is asking for, for funeral goers so will someone die in season three of all the queen's men oh my god when i saw that post so this is what makes me question somebody close to madam is it going to be her father or will one of the other main characters being in tommy blue dime or even amp will any of those t be taken out so, again, you guys, I like I said, I got this from Cab Casting, and I had to give it to you guys. So, just expect that someone is going to be taken out. Now, I don't know if it's going to be in the beginning of this season three, or if they're going to wait till the very end to unalive somebody. I'm really not looking forward to that part, but it is coming. So, then, so what's Madam's next move? Again, we don't know what Blue's next move is, and we definitely don't know the next move of Madam. Um, so then we see Freaky Dicky Big D. Now he is, this is his attempt again to get in good with Dime. He brings her up on the stage, and he asks her basically to help him with this dance routine. So I'm gonna give you guys a portion of the clip and then I'll be right back. All you gotta do is slide. Okay, I said no. Slide to, come on, you gonna do me like that? That's just wrong. Oh well. Come on, Don. Maybe if I make that boy matter, I guarantee you go all the way then. <sighs> uh-huh. Maybe. Mm-hmm. Come on. But... <laughs> 
So as you can see, Big D makes his attempt at getting with Dime. He even attempted to get with her on the stage, told her to pull the paintings to the side, like that she was making him horny. And I'm like, are you seriously trying to screw this girl on the stage in front of everybody? Amp was looking, Tommy had to turn his head because the dance was just getting way out of control. And he even said that, you know, if I make Amp jealous, then maybe you'll give me some. But why is it that they that he wants to get at Amp? Like, what did Amp do to him? Um, he knows that Dime is Amp's girl or even her ex, his ex. So why is it that why is it that Big D wants to get at Amp? What's his next move, you guys? Will he do one more thing to make um to make Amp jealous enough to wear Dime will go ahead and sleep with him. Dime already wants to sleep with Big D. She's just literally playing it off, um, making it seem as if it's only about making Amp jealous. But all I can say, you guys, is that she is definitely playing a crazy game as well as Big D. So what's his next move? Then, last but not least, we have Trouble. Trouble has made her presence known to madam let madam know that she knew that casanova was a cop and madam hands her the gun she says you you say you're loyal you say you want to be all in well then take his life now will she take his life will she actually act on what madam has instructed her to do she's she looked very scared in that scene, you guys. She looked very scared of the fact that she is going to, she was given the instructions to take Casanova out. And a lot of people have been speculating. Is Trouble the police? What else is up to Trouble? What else is there about Trouble? Like, what's really her backstory? Even when it came down to taking Rashawn to her house, she was initially going to allow him to stay there while she was there. However, she wouldn't let him in without her being there. And I understand, just like she said, man, I don't know you, but you were still going to let him stay with you. Which means if he wanted to roam your house, he could have done such a thing you know what i mean you guys so anyway drop your comments below let me know your thoughts on what's their next move again we have trouble we have madam we have blue and we definitely have big d what's their next move thank you all so much for tapping in and tuning in to all things ruthless home of the ruthless addicts if you're new to my channel finding me for the very first time, please hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell for reminders of new Ruthless content. And YouTube seems to think that this is one of my most popping videos. So go ahead, check this video out. Let me know your thoughts in the comment, okay? All right, you guys, that's about it. Thank you so much for tapping in and tuning in. And make sure you come back because tomorrow, EJ and I, Tika Deshaun, will dive in to the latest episode of All the Queen's Men. It's going to be such an amazing time. We definitely had an amazing time last week, and I want you guys to tune in and don't miss the fun. Don't miss the entertainment of us going down into our virtual club eating, okay? All right, you guys, that's about it. Thank you all so much. And you already know, stay ruthless.